What's up guys, it's Alex Melton with Kaiju Island. Today we are going to G-Fest. So, and this will be Kaiju Island's first time at G-Fest, which is awesome. Yeah, I haven't posted any any videos in a while, which which sucks, but there will be lots of videos coming after G-Fest, I promise. But, yeah, so we're super excited to go to G-Fest, and right now I'm going to go get my cousin Thomas up. The co-owner for Kaiju Island is Humphrey, but Thomas is also coming with us to G-Fest. He's Humphrey's brother, so. Hey, freaking get up, you dweeb. <laughs> get up, you dweeb. All right, so uh, initial thoughts upon waking up. What are, what are your thoughts about going to G-Fest? Oh, right. Okay. All right, well, we've got Thomas, though. That's, that's, uh, no, no, he's going back to sleep. Hey, look, look. You gotta get your ass up, man. Okay. We can do it the easy way or the hard way. I'm gonna don fry your ass. Dude, 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 dude. Humphrey just woke up. Time to go G Fest. <laughs> How you feeling? Hey, hey, what do you think? What do you think? What do you think about going to G Fest? I'm feeling pretty dang good. <laughs> dude, I'm ready to get don fried. Don fried. Alright, if you don't mind, I'm gonna get naked and I'm gonna clean my body. Alright. We're ready to leave right now for G-Fest. There's a cat. Cody, are you ready to leave? Yeah, I'm taking my Biolante. Humphrey's mad because he doesn't have one. Good <laughs> block. Start the block! Start! Okay, yeah, we're, we're loaded in the car waiting on our... On our um, Do it live! Do our, it fucking live! On our fat family to uh, get ready to take us to G-Fest. So yeah, we're just waiting here. Oh, we're, just, got my anal beads. we're waiting to get Dawn fried. <laughs> yeah, so we're officially departing. For, for uh, G Fest 25. And then you dox me, then you'll be sorry. <laughs> Dude, I'm trying to get a, I'm trying to get a, a, a frozen. The second uh, degree murder, and the sentence <laughs> to 30 years. Boom, boom, we're at G Fest. Yeah, no, no, we're not. We're actually at the airport, and yeah, we're about to fly in. We're about to fly in. We're gonna make it by lunch. We're, we're gonna get that fucking money, dude. Yeah, we get gotta, that band I get that fresh bite. We're gonna get them bands. Get that. Yeah, but for real, we're at the airport, and we're gonna. We're gonna be flying out to another airport so that we can take a plane to Chicago because we're not lucky like some of you motherfuckers who live like near Chicago. So, yeah. We're taking the Atragon. Yeah, we're taking the Atragon and the Go Tango. <laughs> we're about to get our anus searched. <laughs> hey man, they got a gift shop. Think they got bandages in there? They probably, they, yeah, they probably got bandages. <laughs> <laughs> I miss the, I'm not. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. That's our whip. That's our whip out there. I can fly that. Lamborghini with the two tone. Some dude, nuts. they got dude. They got they snacks. Got some nuts on that. They got some. They got some nutty snacks. So now we're about 45 minutes from flying the plane to G Fest. Yo, if you got a walnut looking head, you can go to bed. We on. We ain't boarding the plane now. We ain't gonna make it to Chicago yet, but we're but we're gonna be on the way there. All right, so we just boarded the plane for G Fest. Thomas is here. Humphrey's all the way over there, sitting with a random noob. We're just chilling, and we're about to get on this flight, and then hopefully be hitting up Chicago soon after we get on the next flight. So I'm gonna get my Bandai Bio Biolante signed. You better believe it, and I'm gonna get double Don fried. We on the way to G Fest. flight all the way to the Chicago. Guys, we're up in Charlotte right now. We're just chilling around the airport trying to check out what's going on. You know, walking around exploring like like bums. We're, we're probably we're like right up in the middle of a restaurant. They we... got cheese sticks. Bro, they got they got naked. Naked. West side. Look at this west side. Chardonnay. That's, wait, is that alcohol? Yeah. There's alcohol right there. Hey. 
<laughs> hey, listen to this music. <laughs> Alright, so we're on the flight to Chicago here, and I gotta sit with a bunch of random people, so that's nice. But we're on the way to G Fest now. Chicago, and we're heading to we're heading up to um, go catch a shuttle to get a G Fest. So Humphreys here, co-owner of the account. In case you guys you know still don't know, for like 50 years, so there's two owners of the account. I'm just in the back. I'm just I'm the guy who records. <laughs> but then, then. Please go to Macaroni Grill. God damn it. God damn fuck, I want to go to Macaroni Grill so fucking hard I'll come in my pants. <laughs> so we're gonna kill it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna. Yeah, we're doing it. Hey, you know what I'm talking about. We arriving at the Crown Plaza. I'm pretty sure this is a guy on YouTube, but I don't know his name because he's irrelevant to my life. Oh, I see it. That's the Crown Plaza right there. What do you think? Are you excited? Um, I'm gonna get a Godzilla figure. Well, what do you think? Are you excited? Yeah. We have arrived at the Crown O'Hare Plaza. This is where it is. First year at G Fest. Can't wait to see Rodan. I hope they, have, I hope they dude. I hope they sell Rodan figures. Yeah, and uh, they fly too. They, wait, they really fly? You mean you mean a? Uh, all right, we're going into the Crown of Hair Plaza. Godzilla stuff. Didn't know what to expect because you know we ain't never been there. Crazy. I saw figures I've never seen before. I saw Here on for you vlog for a little bit. vlog. Um, G Fest. What is up, guys? We're out here at G Fest. I'm Kevin. And today we have a new Fortnite video coming out. I'm Kevin. I get a victory royale with my penis. We're about to get Don Fried. Big time. From Don Fried. Okay. So you can already hear his scrumptious voice. <laughs> Don Fry right there. He's wearing a steakhouse shirt. Hi, Captain of the Go Tango. <laughs> Hungry for steak. <laughs> well, listen to that raspy voice. Listen to that raspy manly voice. <laughs> we just got Don Fry. We got Don Fry's autograph. Don Fry gave me a free autograph. Didn't even, didn't even, didn't even pay for anything. And uh, oh my god. Well, that's terrifying. Shit. Uh, so so basically, uh, Don Fry called Thomas a dumbass and smacked him. So basically, Thomas got Don Fry super hard. I got smacked by Don. Fry. Yeah, Thomas, you got smacked by Don Fry, and he called you a dumbass. That's awesome. Go. Yeah. Right, I'm about to give him a gimme to sign my latte. It's gonna be lit. Boom. Nice to meet you. Okay. I'll get you to sign this. Okay. Oh, uh, that's fine. Yeah, just sign yeah, just, yeah. it. Yeah, let's just sign She's saying her name from the, uh, from the movie. Yeah. Every time. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we're in the dealer's room at G-Fest, and holy fucking crap, this is crazy. 
So we just met Goji Franklin and we're still looking at the dealer's room. They got, they, good, they got a good made beta. They've got a lot of stuff in here. It's pretty crazy. I just bought a Batra. They got a lot of things. Yeah, we're still in the dealer's room. We've been in here for probably almost two hours now, maybe. And it is crazy in here. I mean, they've got all sorts of stuff. And I mean, it's way better than you could ever imagine. Yeah, Humphrey, what do you, how do you feel? Uh, pretty overwhelmed. Oh, yeah? Pretty overwhelmed. Pretty overwhelmed? This is yeah. first day G-Fest dealer's room haul. We see we got some Heisei Gamera stuff and some Showa Gamera. We got Super Gals, Showa Gamera, Ziggura. We've got freaking Batra. We've got Mothra Larva, GMK Ghidorah, 1954 Godzilla special yeah. version, Dude. Rainbow Mothra. Five cents. GMK. Five cents. And this is Humphrey's haul for today. We're gonna come back tomorrow and pick up more stuff. He's got a Final Wars Ice Godzilla, GMK Godzilla. He's he's got a little 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 baby mouth of GMK, you know what I'm saying? Um, he knows more about Ultra Monsters than I do. Oh, that was Zeta. Oh, Claw Mark was the first one. That but yeah, dude, yeah, yeah that's our, that's our haul for today. Yeah. And uh, we also got we also got a uh, Don Fried up. Don Fried up. And I got my Bio Biolante signed by Magume Odaka, which is awesome because she played in that movie, so. That's great. Back right, to so the Crown Plaza after we just left the outlet mall. I got some what dank gas. I got in this hot topic bag. Probably some uh, dank gas. You're wrong. What is it, Gerani Mon? What is dank gas? But I, I uh, thought that, you were thinking it was like a Dragon Ball Z shit. That's Kiloladu. Eat, drink, and be Murray. That's actually that's actually Robot Godzilla. Yeah, that's Robo God. That's Robo Godzilla. That's Robo Godzilla. He's actually Godzilla's cousin. Thomas. Alright, so we're back in the dealer's room. We're just looking around. We've already been in here about twice, but I just guess I'll give Kai I guess I'll give Kai uh, Kaiju Island YouTube a better look at the dealer's room and what's going on in here. Just kinda give a view of everything. It doesn't matter, I mean. We got vinyl figures galore. Vinyl figures, displays. I mean, they've got everything. Plenty of vendors. For the for the account. It's like I don't know what it, what it is. It's like a puzzle. Or like I don't know. It might just be an actual extra going on. I don't know. Puzzle. Uh, did you see that Marmot GMK? I looked at it earlier. So I picked it up. I was like, what? Thomas, what do you think? Rating out of 10. I haven't bought anything. Dude. That's cool. Hey, Humphrey. So, what do you think of the dealer's room? Um, there's some good deals. Some good deals and dealers. Where do you find a Kaiser Ghidorah? We don't. We don't find a Kaiser Ghidorah. That's the problem. I'm gonna ask everyone right now. Humphrey, you can't. You can't talk about your experience at G Fest so far. How it is? Well, it's been one day. Uh, but uh, yeah, I got a. I got a theater exclusive Orga Green. No, he didn't. Five dollars. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. 
Oh, dude, they got the they got the chick from The Exorcist. Kaji wildin' up in G Fest, getting litty 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 three fitty fitty. That's a light. I have an Ella King already. How appreciated their work has been so far away from where they've actually done it. So I think that too is uh, something that's very important about G Fest that goes beyond the the pleasure that we get out of all the activities that we do and, and meeting the guests, but it's the the messages that we've communicated to them over the years as well. And the relationships are real and strong. Uh, I think of uh, Mr. Takarada, who was to be here this year, uh, who I like to call the godfather of G-Fest. He kind of adopted this convention. He's done so much for us over the years. I was here in 2000, actually in, uh, in California in 2000, but it's been 18 years since I've been here. But I haven't changed, huh? <laughs> He says, uh, even she said, even then she remembers some of the pictures taken together and she had seen some of the faces she saw then, now, and it's just a lot of good memories from then, and she hopes to make some more now, too. She, she is very, really ready for the next generation of Godzilla fans as well. She took a picture with a family had a five-week-old child. So yeah. she's ready for the next generation. think of when they hear the word Godzilla. So we're so honored and grateful for you to come back to and help us celebrate our 25th anniversary. Thank you so much. Uh, and the first time when he was going to become Godzilla, he was actually a pinch hitter for somebody else. <laughs> and now 25 years, well, many, many years later, and for the 25th anniversary, he's now the pinch hitter again. <laughs> I got a phone call from Mr. Takarada, and I wasn't thinking about going anywhere, but when Mr. Takarada calls, you listen! And now he looks at me so they're bigger than I am. <laughs> and, and they're really beautiful too. <laughs> that these movies can't be produced without the people behind oh, Donnie the scenes. For and so while we may not have seen our next guest on, on the screen, we've certainly seen the work that he's done on the screen. The suits of many monsters, including uh, Mothra and Baragon and Titanosaurus, and many that I think we would all agree are the most artistic and beautiful and realistic of the monsters as well, and also many of the props that he's worked on. And so we are also very grateful to have with us for our 25th, for the first time, uh, the classic Toho era behind the scenes technician, Mr. Keizo Muase. Bye-bye!
これが、えー、こうやって大勢の方が来てくださいましたことを、えー、心から感謝しておりますありがとうございます I, I am very thankful for all the fans, the staff, everybody, especially all the hearts, the Godzilla hearts of everybody out there. Thank you so much for inviting me. それぞれのものをずっと作ってきましたそれを今この場で本当にここにたくさん並んでいるものがあこれも手がけたあこれも作ったこれも作ったってこう非常に懐かしく自分で思っておりますこれ,もこれをみんな皆さんがですね愛してくれてるということを初めて本当によく分かったので本当に感謝しておりますありがとうございます Very long, but anyway, yeah.、Um, what he said was from the beginning when he started with Toho,、um, starting with Godzilla and Gamera, and King Ghidra, and Daimajin, Gamera, all the other things that he's done, and look in front of him, he sees all of his children here, basically, and then all of the people out here and all the children that they've brought as well, and the generation continue on. He couldn't believe that it would end up this much. And now, in front of all you people after all these years, again, it's unbelievable to me, but I'm so thankful for being here. Thank you again so much. ですから、まだまだこれから生まれてくる子どもたちにも、えー、ゴジラの、えー、この一つの形をですね、永遠と続けて、えー、いっていただきたいと思います。私も、えー、83歳になりましたので、えー、これ以上、えー、怪獣をたくさん作ることはできないかと思いますが、本当に、あのー、これからも皆さんでよろしく、かわいです。My girls were、uh, two and three at the time, and he was so sweet. He took the girls over there to the monster、um, story thing, and、um, you know, they were real cute little kids at the time. <laughs> <laughs> Now they're teenagers. <laughs> But back when they were cute, you know, he says, Now, don't, don't be scared. These, these are just toy monsters. They're foam, you know, they're, they're big, they're frightening looking. But don't, don't be nervous and scared. And they sing, you know, you're looking over there, and my two year old's pulling on Godzilla's tail. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's about, about a half million dollar、uh, figure there, kid. <laughs> <laughs> well, good luck, people. <laughs>
So we're supposed to look at... Uh, Who's talking about green tags? Are this today's time? <laughs> Alright, we're heading into the dealer's room for the second day. So, here we go. Back in here. Restop. I want it. I want it all. It's so weird in here for people. Yeah, it's, still, it's still pretty clean in here. People are still piling in. Let's check and see if there's a Kaiser before, before we miss it. Let's see if there's a Kaiser before. Yeah. Man, they got dinosaurs and bags of dinosaurs. dinosaurs. Oh, dude, they got one of those like Kong things that you know, came out for 2005 with the insects. I, I had, we used to have that one. Yeah, I have I it. Have I still have it. Room. It's not worth that. It's not worth that money right now, though. Not the insect. Not the insect one. The the, 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 the one with the Kong. The one with the Kong figures are worth the money. Yeah, the, but, they, but they, you don't know why they have so many, right? They get them for 15 bucks and sell them for like, oh, how much money, How much do you think they are? Fifteen dollars. Uh, this is fifteen dollars online. Hey, excuse, how much is the buy lot? Thirty. Oh, thirty-five. Sorry. It's that thing we saw last night. See, I told you. No, it's that thing we saw last night. Yeah, I know. Fifteen dollars online. They fucking sell them for thirty-five. That's twenty. That's a twenty-dollar markup. I hate, honestly, I hate this table because those dudes don't do deals on nothing. Sincerity. They got a lot of vinyl figures though. I like this figure a lot. Yeah, that one's pretty awesome. Ingilis. Ingilis. Just to let you guys know, future reference, this guy gives no deals. Just guys, so you guys know I'm not buying this. And he upcharges these figures like crazy. I wonder if they even have the uh, old Bandai by Alonso's here. Yeah, Humphrey over here talking to Lewis. Trying to find, uh, trying to look for, trying to find a grand candle. You guys are good at it. How much? How much you buy that for? The Biolante? Yeah. 40, 40. You can get it for 15 offline. Yeah, I know. I, I actually got it offline, but I waited too long and it stayed in, you know, Hobby Lobby? Yeah, or Hobby, not Hobby Lobby. Or yeah, Hobby, Hobby Link, Link. Japan. I, I got it. Yeah. Alright. So tell us what your best morning figure is here. A 1955 Memorial Box Godzilla. Have you seen it? Hello? Nope. Alright. Let us know. You got good luck. Right. Hey, Thank make you. sure to subscribe Kaiju Island on YouTube. What what, do you, what figure are you looking for the most today? Well, right now, I'm about to buy that um, Great Monster series. I'm just waiting for the rest of my money to get down here. Alright, yeah. that's what's up. Make sure to subscribe to Kaiju Island on YouTube. Right, I will. Thanks. I already got it, though. So. Alright, well, which figure were you looking forward to the most? Uh, the like SH the Monster Arts uh, Gigan. You got one. that. Yeah. You got this. Is it the Final Wars version? Yeah, Final Wars. All right, that's awesome. Thanks. Yeah, that's subscribe awesome. to our account. It's Kaiju Island on YouTube. Kaiju Island? Yep. Well, I will do it. We just came out of the dealer's room again for the second time. Now we're gonna go downstairs and look at some of the art displays. Look what I got. Yeah, Thomas got some of the rarest figures on the planet. It fucking, I got a deal because they came out of the the four dollar bag, but I got them out of the. But then I just told him I got them out of the two dollar bag. And uh, on my second trip, I got a uh, nine hundred and fifty dollar little Godzilla. Isn't that Biolante? Wasn't that here yesterday? No. Looks like the X Plus Biolante just put on. Who did that out of wood? Looks like the X Plus Biolante that's just put on the diorama. Uh, I think that is. I don't know though. Wait, no? No, it's not. The X Plus has like this giant thing sticking out. Well, if that's, a, no if that's a real... That. I'm telling you, these are X Pluses or something. The guy over there is heating something up. He might be making a figure or drawing one. Dude, that's cool. That oh, that's that. That's amazing. No, that's one of the concept Godzillas for the, the one that was going to be the 98, too. That oh, was yeah. one of the concepts. 98 or? Yeah, the Tristar. But actually, no, it was, it was a movie that was going to be made before that 98. It was going to be made in uh, 95. And it was actually going to be like a different movie. 
But then they scratched that when it made the 98. You probably can. You probably find the artist to make offers on them. That one's fucking dope. But they charge a lot of money for because I know it took them a long time to make some of these. That one, that's awesome. Yeah, I know, that one's really cool. I like the one with Kiru and Godzilla. Oh, yeah, I need to. I like the ones with Godzilla in the water. Yeah. The water looks real. That one's cool, but look at how the same Those is. look like they're made by the same guy. Are those figures, or are they... No, they're they're they made those. Or something. Yeah, look how well, he does actually, the same it kind of looks like he, it kind of looks like those were the same thing. He might have bought those and sawed them in half and made the diorama. That came close. I think that one's like so funny. It's like it's like. <laughs> oh, I think it's so super. All these bear guns. Those fighting bear guns are so cool. Yeah, yeah. That Baragon head, that Baragon head is like freaking crazy. Is it a GMK? That one's That, that King Kong sculpture is so cool. Yeah, I know, that one with the skull crawler. Yeah. I hate that one. Dude, they need to make an X Plus skull crawler. They need to make skull crawler figures, like, that'd be awesome. That one's cool. Yeah, Frankenstein. His little torch lights up. Alright, that's literally someone bought that and put it up there. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Same thing with that. Creative. Is that G Fantas? Yeah. Oh, I remember we saw <laughs> that. <laughs> saw that yesterday. yesterday. That one's actually really cool. Like, no matter how simple it is, it's actually really cool. Yeah. It's like Jet Jaguar color. That one's just crazy. Like, they bought this. Yeah. What is this? I don't get. I don't get how. It, I don't get how you can buy figures with them up here. No, it says it's um. Cathoga. Thought it was Cthulhu though. I should have touched the water. This one's awesome. It, it's actually just like hard. Don't touch it. Guys. I see you touch it. Go crazy. Hey, really? I think they use this mod. Uh, they use this modeling stuff called uh, instant water. No, they call it liquid glass. That's what they call it. I don't think you're supposed to walk past the tape. You YouTuber? We're here looking at this dude. That's awesome. <laughs> we got G Fantas here. Hey, get that purse. Got G Fantas. Got some. Sorry. We got all sorts of stuff going on over here. Alright, thank you. I got a Godzilla suit back there. Chat, dude. G Fest crazy, dude. Yeah, man. Drawing to win a G Fantas figure is pretty cool. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. He's G Fantas drawing right now. Names, right? No, me giving away G Fantas okay, figures. They got one left. Yeah, they were we, we, we don't have Kaiju. Yeah, hasn't got any yet. They're gonna win. Big time. Oh, yeah, that's mine. That's mine. Kim. Pazing. All right, so these are the award winners for G Fest 2018.
Megumi, these are all the award winners for G-Fest 2018. Godzilla's had a rough time. to leave so we're gonna go find my cousin the co-owner of the account and we're gonna be up in the dealer's room just because we're looking for my cousin and Godzilla's here so that's cool Alright, so my whack painted sculpture, my cotton candy Godzilla, got a participant ribbon. That's whack. So whack. Alright, so we're off the final flight. Oh, that's a Plodeo down. That's a Plague down. It's like, that's a Stegosaurus. Pretty sure that's an Anki. That's an Angus. That's an Anki. No, but we, we just got off the final flight, heading back home from G-Fest. How was your experience, Thomas? <sighs> How was your experience, Humphrey? Good time. Look at this I had a good time. No, uh, good people. Yeah, and um, you want to go look at the sign somewhere where they wait for their and, luggage? And as for my experience, I had a wonderful time. It was so my awesome going to Jesus for the first time in my life. And that guy sitting beside me on the plane definitely was not gay. 